Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Today I just wanted to go through uh, the G20 CD. This is Asus uh, enter into the gaming market, and I wanted to just show you uh, the operating system, kind of how it comes. I've done a little modification to it, changes uh, the wallpaper. Uh, you're looking at this in a 34 inch Dell Ultra Wide LED. Uh, 3440 by 1440 uh, um, resolution screen. This particular uh, ASUS, um, ASUS I'm running is the G20CB. It's the higher end one. It's got the 16 gigabyte of RAM, one terabyte hard drive, eight gigabyte GTX 1040 video card, and the um, i6700 3.4 gigahertz processor which will I think it can overclock to 3.6 but uh, I'm going to probably be getting a 4 gigahertz processor and I'm going to be getting probably a solid state drive for this down the line but I want to just go through the operating system show you kind of how it comes of course the applications you see here with my mouse pointer on the left I highlight them that's not come like that I have a very, very sensitive Yeti microphone, so it's going to be picking up probably everything I do. Uh, later on, I'll have to subdue that so it doesn't pick up the background noise, but it's a it's a Yeti, and I didn't pay much, about $110 microphone, but it's, uh, it suits the model on that uh, Yeti, uh, Yeti microphone. It's really good. But let's go ahead and first start, and I'm just going to go ahead and show you some of the, you know, the uh, stuff about Windows 10. This is Windows 10 comes with Corona, which is a, like a talking program. Of course, it's not really big now because don't forget I'm running a very big uh, screen. So it's not gonna fill it, kind of neat. But I kind of like that. It, uh, if you go in here, okay, you can click on this and you can get your menuing like this, which is kind of neat. Go back here, okay, kind of neat. Uh, uh, I like I like because you get this menu still, which is a real nice feature of that. Then of course you can get in here. You can try Corona if you want to, but I, I don't like that. I don't like that thing. Get rid of the menu like that. So let's go back over here. Uh, I chose to see these icons on the left hand side here. This is equal to like a my computer, uh, this PC. You right click on it and go to properties. It'll bring it up on the left hand side. Of course, don't forget now, it's at high resolution, so everything's going to look kind of small. And if you see, of course, it's 16 gigabyte. There's for the RAM on the upper left hand side. Watch my mouse, 64 bit. And it's uh, Microsoft Windows on the right hand side. See my mouse, 10. So if we go on device manager on the upper left hand side, I'm clicking. You can go down here and see it's the X64 base PC. There's your Bluetooth, audio, disk drives. I have a lot of disk drives in here. And uh, your DVD is a DVD burner, it's not Blu ray. Firmware, human interface, USB devices, keyboards, of course, uh, USB, mice. Monitor Dell 3417 wide. Now, if you go here for network adapters, the so Bluetooth, Bluetooth, Ethernet connection, and the 802.11 PCI. Now, if we go to portable devices, it has some portable drives in there, print queues, blah, blah, blah. Processors, of course, going to say 3.4 gigahertz, eight. Uh, there's four virtual and four uh, cores, so it makes eight. You get in here, there's your NVIDIA Realtek, and I have a Western Digital Drive in there, an external one. So let's get back out of here. Now there's another feature here. This is your NVIDIA feature for the ASUS. It's really an ASUS combination of NVIDIA, but uh, it is their manager, which allows you to modify, uh, check a lot of settings. And you can see here on the left-hand side, I'm gonna move it a little so you can see it. Uh, you can click on there, allow you to log into Facebook, Twitter, and this is like some kind of, I don't know what it is, let's see. It's called Web Eyeball. Looks Japanese. Uh, you can go to gaming mode here. You can boost different applications if you want to click on them. They'll tell you what you want to boost. You can boost these, make them faster, slower, blah, 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 which is kind of a neat feature to have. Uh, 
Okay, now you can go in here to Game Alive. I don't know what Game Alive is. I'm printing on this. I guess this allows you to do your settings. I clicked on that. I don't know. Oh, maybe it's recording some kind of camera. I'll get out of that. Uh, it did something. I don't know what it did. I guess I shouldn't have clicked on it. I don't know how you can get off of that. I'm going to have to close that window. Okay, and then we're going to open it back up. But it was, it's something related for gaming. That's all I know. Okay, well, I shut that down. There's some applications in here that allow you to do a few things, and I think probably because it's not running it, shut it down, and that's probably why I didn't test it. Uh, but this is kind of, you know, uh, how it looks. Your Asus um, G20. There's some different settings, and there's, uh, you know, there's uh, some programs in here. I like 10 because everything is right there. Isn't it kind of neat? It gives you everything there. You can click right on it. But this is kind of the user interface. Um, and here's your NVIDIA graphics portion of it. That come up. Takes a second. Okay, here it is. You see, you have your different settings. You can open, there's the, you know, different settings in here and here. You can really fool around with it a lot. And you can get into here 3D using this. Uh, configure sound, restore, stereo, uh, stereoscopic, stereoscopic 3D. It's a VR related uh, computer, so you could you could change a lot of neat stuff on that. But I wanted to show you that, and this is the G20 CB by ASUS uh, user interface. I do have some different wallpapers that kind of get a kick out of it to show you. I have here. I downloaded these and they look pretty neat. And then a badass looking. That's a badass one. This is even better. That is neat. And then I have some other Asus ones here. Those aren't weren't Asus ones. These are uh, another one. Another one. That's kind of neat. Eh? This is really subtle. Subtle and red. That's pretty cool. And there, and then we have that one. Uh, my favorite's probably, well, that one's not really bad looking at it. That's pretty cool. Favorite's this one. It's got a little bit, a little nice color. It's kind of neat. It's really clean. But thanks a lot for tuning in, guys. Uh, have a great day.